So as part of my overseas work, I worked on the Karun Dam, uh, which is on the Khuzestan River, okay, in uh, the southwest of Iran. A very interesting project. Uh, it's a 200 meter high Pinarch Dam, very mountainous terrain. It's a very spectacular part of the world. A fantastic, you know, geomorphological process is happening all, uh, all the place. You know, so we were seeing that as a, a young engineer was really quite an experience and I count myself lucky. This is very interesting because I think I uh, got my inspiration from the very same dam. Many years later, as a student, as part of one of our courses, our professor decided to took us to an educational field trip and I was stunned by the height and the scale of the dam. And I needed to know at the time who's the mastermind behind it. And uh, I was told like, yes, I designed it. I think it was, as we're talking, was manifested in me. I had to work in this company someday. The biggest uh, challenge I had when I immigrated to Canada was to understand the culture of the work environment here. OSPI tried to bridge that foreign trained engineers into the Canadian uh, workforce culture. They help you get the volunteer job to get understand uh, the work environment. With the mentorship, you would get familiar with it and then little by little learn everything. When I landed to Canada, I didn't know where to start. And I knew that I wanted to be an engineer. I came here to be an engineer. I came here to work at Hatch. So when I found OSPI, I found like-minded engineers who actually went down that road before and say, okay, where did you start? How did you write your resume? What is cover letter? How should I write that? So by being a member, I get access to the career service and mentorship, which I believe years later, it helped me to do the same thing to others through OSPI or through my uh, own company. 